Hi guys and welcome to this head-to-head -head challenge where we're going to recreate the Champions League round of 16 second leg uh, played between Tottenham Hotspur and Juventus at Wembley. We've got five packs of the Match Attacks Champions League uh, cards for the first half, five for the second half. Any players pulled uh, from those clubs that will score an imaginary goal, you know the rules by now. Let's get straight underway with it. Of course, the Pro 11s uh, don't count. However, uh, we will give away those codes. We'll show them on video. So first come, first serve on them. Uh, but keep a good look out for uh, Tottenham and Juventus players. Will this predict the correct score? Uh, we will find out. So... Uh, there is no goals as you see uh, in that first pack. On to our second. And still no goals, it remains. Uh, Tottenham Hotspur nil, Juventus nil. Of course, if it was to finish like that, then. Uh, Spurs would actually win the game uh, through scoring two goals uh, in the Juventus Stadium. Who's going to grab the first goal? There's the logo, that's cool. And here is the first goal though, as you see, and it's scored by the flying fullback. Uh, ben Davies as you see there uh, so Spurs take the lead at Wembley it's Spurs 1 uh, Juventus 0 onto our pack before half time can Juventus get back into it or will uh, Spurs grab a second And in fact, it is the equaliser through the magician, uh, Paolo Dybala. Uh, so just before half-time, it's now Spurs 1, uh, Juventus 1. On to uh, our, our card before half-time. Final pack, I should say. And there's Juventus' second goal. They take the lead just before half time, and it's through the flying uh, wing back Juan Cuadrado. Uh, makes it uh, 2 1 at Wembley, as you see there. Uh, so the half time score Spurs 1, Juventus 2, and on to the second half. Of course, were it to finish 2 uh, 2. Uh, however, it's not going to now. We would uh, have uh, a lucky uh, pack to see who scores first. Uh, this, but Kadira and Pjanic have uh, combined uh, to make it Spurs 1, Juventus 3. Can Spurs uh, get back into this? Of course, uh, should they uh, equal it up 3 all, then uh, Juventus would progress through on away goals. Can't imagine this happening in the uh, real game, but let's hope it does. And no further goals in that pack there. On next one, and Spurs get themselves back into this game. And they can, and it's through their goalkeeper, Hugo Lloris. Have they sent him forward for a header? Who knows? Uh, but it's Spurs 2. Oh, but uh, Dougie, Douglas Costa has made it 4-2. It's Spurs 2, Juventus 4. So it's uh, seemed to extinguish all hope uh, from uh, Tottenham's chances by the looks of it. But we've still got uh, two packs left. And in fact, they've extended the lead, uh, probably from a free kick through Miralam Pjanic. Makes it 5-2. On to our injury time for the game. It looks all over. The fans are leaving. Here we have. And there is a consolation, though. It's through the French uh, centre midfielder, Moussa Dembele. So, 
Uh, that looks to be ah oh, no, as you can see there, he's popped up at the end with an important goal again. Sammy Kadira, Juventus hits six, and in fact that is the final whistle. So what a goal-scoring game! It finishes Spurs three, Juventus uh, six. Hope you guys have enjoyed the recreation uh, using the Match Attacks Champions League cards. If you have, smash that like button. Uh, check out in the description uh, below. Uh, the playlist for the head-to-head -head challenges. You can see loads and loads of uh, teams going uh, against each other in head-to-head -head challenges. And of course, I'll see you guys all in future Football Cards and Stickers openings. But until then, I'll Wiedersehen.